Howdy, howdy, folks. Welcome to Grim Gaming. This is Grim. Today is June 5th, 2024, and we're going to be playing some GeoGuessr Daily Challenge. Uh, we are currently 156 days into our streak. Uh, we will be going to 157 today. Uh, hopefully with a solid score, either this color or this color. Not this color and not the purple color. Shows up once in my lifetime. Hopefully, only once in my lifetime. Um, anyway, um, yeah, so this does look like it could be a more difficult one in the fact that uh, I do see, you know, some lower scores down here. So um, I see Giovanni's blade. But uh, yeah, let's, um, let's go ahead and get started. As always, there are five three minute rounds. Moving, panning, zooming is allowed. We will not. Or almost any other day. Let's jump into this. If my thing loads. All right. So, first thought here is Baltics with the wide uh, gravel road and you know these northern-looking plants, trees, I should say. We do have some white flowers there. Um, some people, not these ones here, but right over here. Um, some people say white flowers equal Estonia. Some people say white flowers equals Lithuania. There is some language up there that I cannot see, cannot read. I can see the language, I just can't see it enough to read what it says. Definitely going to be Baltics. Um, Does not look like a square concrete pole. This looks like a wooden pole, I think. And if so, that would indicate it could possibly be Estonia. Um, I believe Estonia also is the one that doesn't have a white outer rim. I'm not 100% certain, but I believe this is a stone. It was Estonia. Pretty nice. Uh, thankfully, it was right in the middle there, so that's a nice guess. Uh, white road line. Black car. White road lines in a black car. I'm confused. Um, black cars. Um, you could have them in Argentina, Uruguay, Peru. You could also have them Jordan, Philippines, Indonesia. I don't know if you can have them in Malaysia or not. Obviously, this isn't uh, Southeast Asia anywhere. This is not Jordan. It's not Peru, based on the landscape, and not... Uh, here anyway. So, process of elimination says that this has to be Argentina, presumably far south with the climate here. Um, we did have one down here um, not too long ago. Um, so, that could be a pretty, where was it? It, was, it might have been somewhere down here. It was in this province here, right down here, I don't remember. It was in this southern uh, Santa Cruz province. Um, so we'll go Santa Cruz again. Um, and uh, it was actually Tierra del Fuego, um, Rio Grande. 
um, pretty close to a city actually, and uh, yeah, um, not a very good score. Lost over a thousand points there. I I'm not gonna say that I thought it was Tierra del Fuego, um, but uh, I wonder if maybe I don't think they all have. Let's um, check a different road. That's a dirt road. Yeah, I mean, I, I expect mainly dirt roads anyway. But, uh, just try it. Yeah, like, you don't see a lot of... Uh, yeah, so it, it should be... Theoretically, it should be a... Uh, yellow side line, or yellow middle lines. Um, I'm not sure why it was white. Um, not that that would have made any difference at all in my guess, because uh, I, I still had to have been Argentina by process of elimination. It looked super far south. I just didn't go far enough south. Um, let's see here. This is not Argentina or at least not South Argentina. This looks like it could potentially be Taiwan. I mean, I, I, Thailand with these ports. Um, we're going to say this, this could be Southeast Asia. Um, but those poles are Taiwanese poles. Um, also possible to find them in Sri Lanka as well. The ones we saw the other day had the poles that went down to about here and not any further in Sri Lanka. But I have seen them with all the holes down here um, as well. Um, I think you can probably find those poles also in Laos, but I'm not sure. I don't think this is a Laos uh, car. If I'm Remembering correctly, last uh, the, the car without the uh, poles, uh, rails has like a funky uh, shaped uh, silhouette. I think I could be wrong. Um, but if I had to guess, it'd be either Thai, Cambodia, or Lao. Um, so we'd be there. It was Thai, close to the Cambodian border, um, 100 miles away. We lost a little over five five hundred points, so we're unfortunately starting to lose. Uh, I think we're about seventeen hundred points down right now. So we've got to do a little bit better if we want to keep potential. Now this here is going to be Singapore. You can tell with the uh, bus stop, the black and white here. It's driving left. English, tropical look. Um, Coast of Rome, Singapore buses. Unfortunately, all the signs are right there that I need. Um, we are on a kind of east westish road. I'm going to see if maybe Costa Grove is something. I don't think they would have a uh, a neighborhood. Um, I don't really know. We'll put it like there. Kind of on this east-west-ish type thing. There. I don't know. Coast to the like, unlike the other day, there's no uh, tram line that runs through it, uh, rail line. Um, I really don't know where this could possibly be. I'm just, like, skimming. 
And I think I'm just going to go ahead and go with what I've got there because I don't know where else it would be. I mean, I don't know where it would be, period. I'm, it's not like this is a great spot. I may do it right there just to... Um, do it right there. It's usually not up in this area. This is kind of down. Yeah, let's go. Let's go right there. Let's see what... And it was over here. Hasir... Reese Drive. Um, could I have seen anything there? Is rivers visible? I don't think I would have been able to see much of anything. Um, apparently there was a river right around here somewhere. Doesn't help. River somewhere in this direction. Doesn't help. And then like I said, I really couldn't see much going this direction because this is they're, they've got this walled off and they're building stuff there. So I don't know that that would have helped at all because that, that would have been this area here. Costa Grove, if I had zoomed in here, but I'd have had to been way zoomed in to even see that. Um, if I'd seen Pasir Reese or something like that, I think this area is that name. But I didn't see that anywhere. Like I said, Costa Grove was there, but you had to be super zoomed in there. So, all right. We do have a uh, dirt road. We have trees with white markings on the bottom. I was going to say. I know Romania marks their trees like this. These are not usually the type of trees I would see them marked on, I don't think. It doesn't really look Romanian to me, but I'm not 100%. Um, do I have anything better to go on? I don't see any power poles. There are power poles over this direction, but they're just not close enough to see. Um, what do we think about the antenna or thing? Could this be Hungary? Hungary also has had that in some locations. It would look more like Hungary than Romania to me. But I've also seen like Ukraine with you know with the white painted bottoms. Probably some other places in this area. Um, let's see if I go with like not the more rugged area of Hungary, but maybe down here. Let's go down here close to Romania border. Um, I said it, it honestly looks more like uh, like Hungary than Romania, but it's not low cam. So, because you do see cornfields um, in like Switzerland sometimes, but I don't know about those. Uh, there's a mountain over there. It looks like or a hill. It's only one, it looks like, and it might not even be that. I don't know. Um, like I said, I, I think, I don't think this is Romania. It is possible. Maybe there's some fire down here, smoke. Um, I'm just going to go with this uh, hungry guess, and hopefully it's close there. It's actually um, Croatia. Um, it was... Not too awful far from my thing, 145 miles, but uh, I didn't think Croatia at all. I'm not sure why. Um, I'm just not familiar enough, I guess, but like, I didn't see anything that would have allowed me to, to make a guess there um, as far as like one that would lead me to Croatia because basically with Cro Croatia, you know, I mean, 
I'd have to see, like, you know, like, like you can tell sometimes, they, you know, they don't have, like, the, uh, the EU plates and stuff like that um, in the older coverage. Um, there are certain things that when I see them, you know, it kind of gives me Croatia vibes. This honestly didn't, but, I mean, I guess, I don't know. I've hardly ever been in this side of Croatia on Google Maps. Um, generally, it's this side, so that would probably be why. It didn't really look all that familiar. Um, there is a chance, slight chance, that I may... I don't think so. I think I am just under gold, I think. I think I'm at 22.3 or 22.4. 22.4, yes. Oh, no, 22.5. Right, so barely, okay. I hadn't lost quite as many points as I thought I did, but that was actually a pretty good round. This one here, uh, I was way far off. Um, that I was pretty far off. Super lucky guess there. Obviously, Singapore guess, you know, you can't do, you know, can't do much worse than that. Um, that Thailand guess uh, wasn't terrible. It wasn't great either. Um, still 100 miles off. But at least it was, you know, not much further than that. But yeah, I, th I thought I was at like 22.3 or 22.4, but uh, thankfully uh, w between the 32 points and the 57 points here, um, you know, like I said, because uh, um, I, I was basically just going off of like kind of rounding it to, you know, I was thinking 49, 39, 44, 49, you know, so that kind of like, you know, that kind of helped out, you know, um, so not actually a bad round at all. Um, like I said, I got lucky in Estonia. Um, wasn't 100% certain, but pretty certain it was, you know. Um, and like I said, the location was perfect for a hedge. Like I said, just middle, you know, middle clock that worked. Um, this is actually a pretty solid um, hedge location here too. Um, now, if it ended up being over here, um, it would have been rough. But uh, um, but for that location in Croatia, like I said, I, I don't know that I, I can't think of any time that I've ever been over here in the location on GeoGuessr. Um, I'm sure I have. Um, this city name sounds familiar, um, but I have such bad memory sometimes that uh, I just, it doesn't doesn't ring a bell as far as ever being over here. I'm sure I have a few times. I'm sure. Um, I'm still kind of like I probably should have gotten this, you know, because I knew it was southern Argentina. I probably should have gone further south, but there was always this, you know, well. What if it's you know up here you know type of thing you know, um, but I thought it would be like maybe Santa Cruz province, but obviously it wasn't. Um, so definitely could have been been better there. Um, like I said, uh, got fairly lucky with the tie guess here. Um, again, it was still a hundred miles off, which you know doesn't really look that far. When you, like it was kind of basically a middle middle high hedge. Um, could have definitely been way worse, like it could have been down here or something like that, or way up there. Um, so I guess I got lucky there going uh, hedge tie, like middle hedge tie, but uh, it was still 100 miles off. Um, overall, though, I believe we got our gold. Uh, hopefully, we continue on our winning ways. And the main thing, it's gold. Uh, main thing is we got to 157 days. Um, so hopefully, we purge this pretty soon. And get a whole strand of these golds here, or at least silvers. Um, but anyway, thank you guys for watching, and y'all have a good day.